Here's a project I ran across and thought it might be helpful for handrails and concrete stairs. And you can see right here, this right here would be a very weak handrail. It's really nothing stabilizing it. And uh, thought that it might be better if we actually bolt the post onto the outside. All this would require would be some anchor bolts embedded into the concrete to stabilize the post. And you can see right here that we have a four by four post and one anchor bolt. This has a flat washer. You can use round washers, as you'll see later on in the video. Make sure that you hold the post off of the ground. Make sure that it's not touching the concrete. Quarter of an inch would be fine. And uh, if you do, make sure that you clean it every once in a while. It's uh, common. I've seen people take these off the ground uh, three quarters of an inch, and eventually you've got a pile of leaves and dirt, and uh, the wood post is starting to rot. So keep that in mind. Wanted to give you an idea of what it would look like with the anchor bolt into the concrete. You might need a longer anchor bolt, a 14-inch anchor bolt not a six inch anchor bolt. I'd go with a little longer one. And then make sure that the anchor bolt, the J bolt part of it is turned in. Either turn it in or turn it down, but uh, don't have it going out to the front. It's gonna be a little bit stronger if it's uh, the more, uh, or the more that this section is embedded into the concrete. And you can do the same thing with a post up here and run them around your stairway. Um, you can use two bolts instead of one. You can always make this one a little longer and full length. Um, and this is just gonna provide you with a little more support. Something like this, one bolt might do, but uh, two bolts might do a little bit better. Here's an example of what it would look like if you had a square washer um, notched into the post. How you accomplish this, I believe that up to you, probably with a router, um, could do it with a chisel. Here's a round washer um, on the outside of a post, and here's what the round washer would look like countersunk into the post. And of course, you could do this with a larger drill bit. Uh, another thing you might want to do is cut the threads off. I see this a lot. Um, you'll see patios built and the threads are the um, threaded part of the anchor bolt is sticking out two inches. This is going to uh, snag someone's clothes or even hurt somebody. Keep in mind that most building codes do require to see at least two of the threads visible. Um, on the anchor bolt. So you can't cut the um, anchor bolt flush with the nut. Give it about a quarter of an inch or a half inch depending upon what size uh, bolt, anchor bolt you're using. I uh, wanted to pull away here and give you an idea of what the post might look like if you're going to be going around a concrete stairway with a landing. You might not be able to put a post in the corner. It might require two posts like this. You know, if we were to take the corner here and line it up with this corner here, how would you bolt it to the, um, to the concrete? So that'd be something to think about. And here's what it would look like on the other side. And here's what the anchor bolts would look like. Just wanted to give you a another view of it here. Sometimes it's hard to imagine what the anchor bolts would look like, how they actually work. And uh, there it is. Now it wouldn't be a bad idea to install some type of a membrane, maybe roofing paper, um, window flashing paper, or even a sheet metal, galvanized metal, in between the post and the concrete. But that would all depend upon how much moisture you actually get in your area. You know, if you live in a wet climate where it rains a lot or you have snow sitting on the ground for a while, you might want something between the post and the concrete to prevent the moisture that gets absorbed in the concrete from absorbing into the wood. You live in a drier climate, the desert, uh, this might not be necessary. So anyway, that's it for this video. Hope it helped, and if it does, feel free to hit the old thumbs up button.